so here you can see I already set the file it's very simple effect you can easily create this effect so we first of all you have to create the base oh sorry all right and after that just uh, create a hole in center of this geometry or you can use tube as well it's easy to create then add some objects around this hole uh, you can see this geometry animated geometry around this hole and um, around the circle it's very easy to animate you can uh, manual you can use manual animation for this rotation just do one thing just select all these objects go to rotation and rotate them in local axis oh sorry it's uh, yeah yeah that's it then just change the timing of each and every object and you will get this kind of effect you then just go to our base object and add FFD cylindrical FFD and just, just animate these points FFD points to make this effect alright now uh, it's time to make our important part which is the tentacles but and for that you have to use shapes like splines you can your you can create your own shapes use your own splines only make it uh, very attractive <laughs> so let's see how I did this let's select one tentacles and spline just turn off all the modifiers it's very simple cone then add one noise modifier on it to make surface make the surface little uneven then add turbo smooth then use UW mapping or you can use your own texture then go to our part deform just assign part deform modifier and then pick the path alright and just click on move to path option and yeah on zero frame make the straight zero and after frame 60 just increase it you can stretch it as per your requirement all right then you can use rotation animated rotation you can twist this object yeah that's it so this is very simple effect you can create it very quickly just uh, make same process use same process and use same parameters for every tentacles but uh, just change the timing of every tentacles and try to make it more attractive yeah that's it you can use your own texture on all tentacles or base then you can use your own lighting it's all about your creativity I just use two lights one is very light with dome shape and second is your target spot yeah it's a very simple use multiplier 0 0.5 of very light and 0 0.5 same for our target spot then go to our render setup and use indirect illumination make some little fast parameter changes use current preset low in this map yeah that's it and add use v red z depth map for just focus and defocus in compositing and just hit the render button that's it <laughs> let's go to our 
after effects after finish the rendering let's go to our after effects for compositing so here you can see our after effects file it's quite easy just add background i use jungle image add some fast blur for defocus and you and saturation is you can change yourself then add tentacles on it then add z depth all right we will use uh, adjustment layer to use z, z depth let's go to adjustment layer and add sapphire z blur and just use z buffer as a z depth pass all right and just turn it off and you can use our focal depth depth of field you can make changes as per your requirement then uh, create some photo filter and add some color correction on it and yes extra extra effect <laughs> all right yeah this is the compositing setting so i think it's very easy to understand so i hope you learn something from this so thank you very much for your time and we will meet in our next tutorial so till then have a nice time